welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the Libra Sun Moon Horizon sign hello 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 I want to say happy birthday to all you Librans um, who is having birthday from the 23rd of October until the 29th thank you for being here thank you for being back this year is going to be um, the energy of a water year and it's going to be emotion because secrets um, your intuition is going to be high there's a lot going to be a lot of secrets and that sort of a thing I want to say also to you Librans happy birthday and for you guys um, every three reading from my website there is 15% off okay so if you order three different readings from my website there is 15% off and um, there is new there are going to be new things that is coming in so be aware of that let's check out your year reading so i'm seeing the energy of the star coming up for you liberals which is good there is some judgment call that is coming in um then we have a cycle ending and that is a really nice in a year when a cycle is ending i'm seeing some of you is going to be having a spiritual year i'm definitely seeing a new start that is coming up for you liberals i'm seeing the energy of the devil that a situation is coming to an end and i'm seeing the energy of the hangman now let's see what is going to be your overall energy with the energy of the moon is that you have the energy of the wheel of fortune okay you have the energy of a wheel of fortune so um this is really really good this is exciting this is good um let's look and see um what we have here so as we look at this energy, these energies are very beautiful because what you can see basically is that you're having situations that is coming up where we have the energy of judgment. We have the energy of uh, um, issues and situation that is going to be transparent. I'm seeing you coming in with healing. I'm seeing you leaving this year for you guys um, on a new part where the wheel of fortune is going to be helping some of you okay so whatever that was happening whatever that was transpiring i'm seeing these energies that is coming up and it's going to be good um because it's going to be a very positive alignment of, of energy whenever we have these energy coming in it's always positive alignment of energy so um, this is a um, very very good whatever the issues is and the issues that was playing um you liberals are going to be seeing and feeling um this energy in this year okay so um it's as if you're healing stuff so let's take a deeper look um for you liberals um for the people who were born on the 23rd this is going to be good because you have the energy of the star this is an air energy that is going to be balancing you out and this is very good because what is transpiring for you is that some of you could have been going through a lot of issues whatever the situation was whatever that was happening a lot of you could have been going through some issues and what is happening and what is transpiring for the people who were born on the 23rd there is a, going to be um, a balance that is coming in your life and this is going to be good for you people who were born on the 23rd because this balance um, is that you are dealing um, with someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and whoever this person is it could be a mother figure and you're trying to figure this out and trying to balance out issues and situations in your life and not to worry about that because whatever it is and whatever this healing and the situation is for you people who were born on the 23rd I'm seeing as if you're going to be finding yourself okay it is a year where there's an healing that is coming in between you and a mother figure between you and other people and there is definitely an healing that is coming in so whatever the issue is whatever the situation is i'm seeing all of this that is going on and what is transpiring and what is happening is that there is balance that is coming in and this balance is there is a healing for the people who were born on the 23rd of october uh september and it is going to be happening right after your birthday this year is just going to be an healing you're dealing with feminine the energies of femininity so some of you could be working to balance out the masculine and the feminine in this year and some of you are definitely going to be having an issue with someone who is uh, 
um, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius okay whoever this person is and whatever the issue is and the situation I'm seeing a healing coming up between you and this person okay so let's see what other message is coming up definitely tw twice the star for you guys who were born on the 23rd um twice the energy of the star which is just so beautiful you can look at this energy and see how beautiful it is because definitely an healing is coming in for you okay definitely you can see this healing because uh, some of you are going to be uh, balancing out and 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 coming up with a positive result of an healing um for an issue or a situation and remember that these reading affect each and every person so for the people on the 23rd 24 25th 26 27 um 28 and the 29 it affects all of you this is the central um where some fortune some unexpected luck is going to be coming through and this is where sit issues and situation is going to be living in your life bringing some fortunate situation now some of you are dealing with an Aries person this is an older person whoever this person is you got to be um you're you're in a situation with this person whoever this person is okay as we look at the people who were born on the 24th this is the energy of the eon the judgment the energy of the eon this is wonderful this is beautiful this is positive because what it is transpiring is that uh, you are going to be receiving information you're going to be learning more you're going to be understanding more um there is uh, information that is going to be coming out and let's see now a Pisces cancer or a scorpion there is going to be some judgment call over this person whoever this person is this is a woman 45 years and older this could be your mom so this could be a scorpion woman definitely this is a scorpion woman where some judgment is definitely going to be coming out about this person whoever this person is and whatever this person has done um there is um a judgment a judgment call that is coming up for this lady because this lady seems to have done some injustice or something now it could be a mother figure okay and um um whoever this person is it could be a mother figure whoever this person is coming up as it could be a mother figure but on the other end this person could be coming up as someone who you're dealing with um just in general okay this is definitely a pisces person whoever this um person is a pisces because um um a pisces or an uh, pisces or a uh cancer this is a pisces or a cancer woman where um there is a, going to be some conflicts a pisces or a cancer woman there is going to be some conflicts now whatever the is issue is and the situation okay whatever the issue is the situation is um you are going to be finding out that this um cancer woman or um, this can be a, a scorpion a pisces or a cancer there is going to be some conflicts okay there is definitely going to be some conflicts so you you have to be aware of it so this is an emotional year because it's the year of the moon and uh, whoever is born on the 24th definitely there is a there is definitely a conflict and an issue and this has to do with an aquarius an, an aquarius person okay because um it could be the sister it could be the family it could be whoever this person is because this person is coming up and it's um the five of swords it is an aquarian okay so there's a judgment call that is going to be coming up on an aquarian okay so um um some of you are going to be receiving um some um information and a judgment call is going to be coming up on an aquarian so whatever the issue is and whatever the, the the situation is is that it could be siblings it could be um people that you're dealing with um it could be work situation because this is connecting to a group of people because there's going to be a judgment call coming up you're connected to a group of people but there, there's definitely going to be a judgment call that is coming up because whatever the issue is and whatever the situation is there is a definitely a situation and a judgment call that is going to be coming out on the Aquarian. I am seeing that uh, um, someone is going to be trying to offer you something. And, um, you know, it is beautiful to, to connect with people and whatever the issue is and the situation. Okay, so that is good. Now, 
as we uh, go forward, um, we are seeing um, this energy of an investigation is going to be over. Okay, an investigation is going to be over. Um, whatever the issue is, whatever the situation is, the lies and deception is going to be over. Whatever lies and deception that was there in the organization, this is going to be God. Okay. So there was some lies and deception in an organization, whatever that was plain, whatever lies and deception in an organization. I'm seeing that this is going to be over because an investigation was taken uh, has taken place in an organization. Now it can be an organization. It can be that some of you are going to be receiving information. It can be lies and things in a, in a company that you weren't aware of. And this is going to be coming to an end. Okay. So whatever the issue is, whatever the situation is, lies and deceptiveness in a company that you're going to be definitely hearing about. Now, whatever that has happened and whatever that has transpired, I'm seeing whoever and whatever has transpired for the people who were born on the 25th you are going to be coming out of this situation this situation is 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 going to be ending because some of you have gotten caught up in issues and situation with an organization and this is definitely definitely going to be coming out because here you can see that an investigation has taken place in an organization and there was a lot of lies and deception. This situation is going to be ending for you guys. As we look at the people who were born on the 26th, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, twice the energy of the hermit. So this year is going to be a year where you're either, um, this could be a good year to write a book. So if you guys are deciding to write a book, it's going to be a good year to write a book because whatever is happening is that the hermit, the hermit information is going to be coming out. The energy of the hermit has to do um, with a positive alignment from energy where information is going to be coming out. It's, it's, it's as if it's situation that has transpired and occur is going to be coming out and it's going to be coming out in the in the open okay so we have hermit a lot of you are going to be going within okay a lot of you are going to be going within a lot of you are going to be connecting a lot of you are going to be trying to find inner peace um and let's hope that and whatever it, it is and whatever is coming out is that some information is shining down on people and situation um, in your life. So it's as if you're seeing things about people in authority. It's as if you're going to be shining a light on people or in authority to show that whatever that has happened and transpired, people in authority has overgone their boundaries and that sort of a thing. And you're going to be opening up a door and showing um, whatever has transpired, but I'm seeing you cut in through a lot of things, um, especially when it has to do with, um, people in authority. So for the liberants that was born on the 26, 20, 4, 5, 6, 26. Let's see what's happening for the liberants who were born on the 26th. The hermit and, uh, um, people in power is here. An uh, investigation is going to be taken. Um, um, uh, um, an Aries man, an Aries businessman, or a businessman, or people in power for some of you. So, what is this all about? Uh, yeah. So there is um uh, and 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 money and and people in power, whatever they have done, um, has paid money to do something, some service, something. Um, whatever they have paid um, money illegal people have paid money illegally to do something and it has to do with a businessman and this is going to be coming out congratulations so let's look at the people and for you guys this is a very lucky year because whatever is transpiring whatever is happening it's as if you're um, you're the whistleblower for you guys. So if you were born on the 26th, you're going to be the whistleblower over an organization and some money. You're going to be showing up and be the whistleblower over an organization and some money. Okay. And this is very, very good. So, um, money could be coming to you guys. Unexpected money could be coming to you guys. And this is going to be good. 
Now we're dealing with um, the people who were born on the 27th. You're going to be having a new start. This is really a beautiful new start that is coming in. Um, you're going to be on a journey. I'm seeing some of you having a new start without in this Knight of Pentacles. Whatever this Knight of Pentacles has done, this could be a child. This could be your partner. Whatever this person I've done, I'm seeing you walking away from this person. I'm seeing you looking forward and moving forward in your life and releasing this person from you. Even though this person is, is here kind of offering you something, I'm seeing you saying, you know, for what you have done. So a transition is coming in. So a lot of you, a transition is coming into the Knight of Pentacles. Whoever this Knight of Pentacles is, and whatever that was happening and whatever that was transpiring, whoever this Knight of Pentacles is, there is a situation where there is a transition that is coming in for this Knight of Pentacles. So an end is coming in for this Knight of Pentacles. I'm seeing a lot of you are having this new start, whether or not you're walking away from this person or you're just realizing that there is a no reason to be in a relationship with this person or this child or whoever. There is some secrets that is coming to an end. Whatever it is, the secrets uh, or the end to a news from the Knight of Pentacles. Whatever this energy is and whatever that is transpired, there is an end to a news from the Knight of Pentacles. There is transition. Money is going to be returned to you. Okay, so let's look at this and let's uh, transpire. As we move on and we have nine so something is ending with the knight of pentacles la mort um the knight of pentacles and this new start la mort so there could be an end to an issue and a situation you're going to be receiving a message about this 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 knight of pentacles after return some money there's a transition and a new start and um, people who were born on the 27th, you have also the number 27. So there is really luck that is coming in. Um, 27 is nine. So you have one and debt is 13, um, 13 and four. So you have uh, one, nine, 13 and four for you guys. Okay. I'm going to tell the rest of the number for the rest. The energy of the devil is here and it has to do with the Knight of Cups, whoever this person is. And um, the energy of the devil is the energy of you being bonded on something. This is the eight. There's news that is going to be coming in from a young person. So whoever this um, young person is, is a Pisces, Cancer or a Scorpion, there is going to be news coming in from this young person. Okay. And this young person is definitely going to be all for you love. Now, Whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring is as if you're you are bounded to this person, whoever this person is, is as if this is a relationship. This could be someone who you love or someone you're in love with or whatever the issue is and the situation. And as, whatever that has been happening, whatever that has been transpiring is as if, you know, you are bounded um, to this issue, this situation, whatever the issue is. And you are going to be successful over this. If, did you see that? It's just flip out. Success. You're going to be successful over this. You're going to be coming over this. You're going to be standing your ground because whatever the issue is and whatever the situation, you can see the success that is coming, that you are going to be successfully overcoming an issue that you were dealing with. So you have the energy of the devil, which is 15, 15, and one is six. You have eight, uh, um, uh, 31, four, and one. Okay. So write these number down, 1, uh, 15, uh, 6, 8, um, 4, and 31. So what is happening here? Use these number in this year because as you use these number in this year, you're going to be seen. But some of you are definitely going to be having some Casanova, some issues with relationships, some issues with um, problems, and you're going to be feel bounded to someone. And this is the energy of the devil. As we look at the people with um, the energy of um, hanging in limbo, some of you are dealing with a Pisces. There's going to be some heartbreak. And um, the seven, you need to stand your ground. Some of you are dealing with some Pisces. There's going to be some heartbreaks. Or you're dealing with someone where there is going to be a, some heartbreaks and you need to stand your ground. 
So whatever is this and whatever is transpiring, I'm seeing heartbreaks coming up for some of you. You're in limbo. You're trying to figure out which direction to go, what is happening. You're in limbo and um, what is transpiring and what is happening is that you need to move forward and you need to let this thing go. You need to move forward. You need to let this thing go. Okay. So I'm seeing some emotional um, issues that is going to be coming up. I'm seeing you having emotional issues that is going to be coming up. You can see um, these emotional issues that is going to be coming up because the eight of wands, whatever these emotional issues, whatever these outbreaks, whatever that is transpiring, you're seeing this coming up and what is transpiring. You need to know that you're going to be overcoming this. Okay. So you guys have three, five, seven, 12. Okay. Three, five, seven, 12. So it's going to be a very rough year for the people who are born on the 29th um, because whatever is happening for the people who were born on the 29th, you are going to be having this issue and this situation going on. And what is going to be happening and transpiring is that the energy of the Wheel of Fortune is coming up where fortune is on your side and this is going to be good. Okay, so wonderful, positive energy. Let's see. Um, what the, um, the fairy have sexuality here comes up, but this is the energy of what some of you are going to be having. The wheel of fortune is here. Sexuality. I'm seeing some of you really getting over an issue with, uh, um, uh, the king of cups and, uh, um, you have the energy of sexuality. Now, whatever this is and whatever that is happening or whatever that is transpiring, um, here you go having this energy and, um, you know, this is good. It's about feeling good about yourself. It's really, um, feeling good about yourself, not being, um, worried, just feeling good about yourself. And this is going to be good. So ladies and gentlemen, I want to say thank you so much. And let's give the people the number from the 23rd. If you were born on the 23rd, there's definitely going to be a eel and there's twice 16, so 601 is seven. Um, and there is an issue that you're dealing. Um, so 601 is seven, 14 and five. Okay. Um, then we have two, um, judgment call, um, an invitation judgment call, and I'm seeing five. So you have uh, two twenty five. Okay. Two twenty five. Then we have 10, we have the 19, 10, 19, and the universe. So this is 21, 19, and 10, okay? Then we have um, the hermit, and this is going to be a lucky year for the people who were born on the 26th. This is going to be a very, very lucky year for the people who were born on the 26th because what I'm seeing is money is going to be coming in because some of you could be, um, having issues with people in authority, that sort of a thing. Money is definitely going to be coming in. Okay. So this is good because you're seeing the money coming in success and emotion that is happening. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Um, thank you. Please like, um, leave a like and share. And remember as from the month of October, you can buy October, um, reading, love reading. No, love reading is free. Um, but any three readings from my website, whether um, last year, October, this year, October, and the full moon reading, it's going to be three readings um, with 15% off. Uh, happy birthday, and I'll speak to you next week.